Module six, lesson two homework. Number one, use a set square to draw a line perpendicular to the x-axis through point P. Label the new line as the y-axis. So I went ahead and drew them on here. Um, so you just wanna make sure that your line that you draw is perpendicular. You might not have a set square at home. I didn't, so I just used a, um, a ruler. You can put a piece of paper, a piece of paper corner of a piece of paper will work as a set square to make sure that you have 90 degree angles. Um, it says label the new line as the y-axis. So I'm going to label this as the y-axis. And B says choose one of the sets of perpendicular lines above and create a coordinate plane. Mark five units on each axis and label them as whole numbers. So I'm just going to use this one. So there's my origin. And then on my x-axis, I'll have one, two, three, four, five. Let's label them. And my y-axis will have five. One, two, three, four, five. And we've created a coordinate plane. Number two, use the coordinate plane to answer the following. Now, letter A, name the shape at each location. So at X coordinate two and Y coordinate Y. So I always remember the X and Y coordinates um, because Y, when I draw Y, this is long. So if it's ever not labeled, maybe that silly trick will help you. But I always remember that the vertical is Y because Y kind of has a vertical line in it. But anyway, so X coordinate two, Y coordinate Y. So X coordinate two would be right here. And Y coordinate Y, we're gonna go up one, two, three. Oh, sorry. That's probably a mistake that a lot of you would make. So notice that each one is two, up two squares. So one, two, three, four, that is the circle. X coordinate coordinate five, so five, and then up four. One, two, three, four is, you can call that a rhombus, you can call it a square, you can call it a parallelogram. One, five, so here's one, and then up five. One, two, three, four, five is the triangle. And five, one over five, up one is the heart. What shape is two units from the x-axis? So this right here is the x-axis. Which one is two units away? So here's one unit. This is two units. So the only one on this line right here that's two units away is the star. And then what shape has the same X and Y coordinates? So we're looking for something that's like one, one. So there's nothing at one, one. Is there anything at two, two? There's nothing here at two, two. At three, three, there is a square. So that is the one. There's, and then there's nothing else at four, four, or five, five, or six, six. So that's the only one. Number three, use the coordinate plane to answer the following. So this time they're giving us the shape and they want us to give the coordinate. So the moon, here's the moon. The moon is at one, two, three, oh, nope, it's at two and a half. And then four. So the X coordinate is two and a half. And then the Y coordinate right here is four. The sun right here is at, the X coordinate is four. And then the Y coordinate, if you move over, is three. The heart, the X coordinate is one, and the Y coordinate is two. The cloud, the X coordinate, it's zero. And the Y coordinate is four and a half. And then the smiley face, the X coordinate, Let's move down, is right there, three and a half. And then the Y coordinate is five and a half. 
which two have the same y coordinate. So we're looking for ones that would be the same going along this y axis. And so that would be the only, the only place I can draw a line and two will cross would be the star and the heart. Plot an x at 2, 3. So we're going over 2 and then up 3. So that would be right there. Plot a square at 3, 2 and a half. So here's 3. x coordinates 3. 2 and a half is right here. And we're plotting a square. Plot a triangle at 6, 3 and a half. So 6 is all the way over here. And then up to three and a half is right there, and we're plotting a triangle. Mrs. Palmer wants to bury the time capsule 10 yards behind the school. What else should he do to make naming the location of a time capsule more accurate? So if he wants to build a time capsule, what I would suggest is adding coordinates to give an exact location of the time, cap no, time capsule.